Teachers and staff in Blanchester are hoping that more cuts aren't coming to an already thin district. Tonight, hundreds of them came to the Board of Education meeting looking for answers. Our Brett Underwood was also there. Those who came out tonight, they're mad. They just don't want to lose their jobs. They want to teach. They want to be here for the kids and they want to get paid a decent wage, a wage that was set by a contract. Now tonight, teachers wore red to show solidarity at tonight's Board of Education meeting. Here's the issue. Last year, the Board of Education and the Teachers Union reached a deal on a three-year contract. This year, no pay raise in order to help the district save money, and the teachers agreed to pay a 1% increase in their insurance costs. The next two years of the deal, the teachers were supposed to get a 2.5% raise each year. Last month, the teachers union president says the board came to him and asked them to go back on the deal and to not take the raise that they were promised by that contract the next two years in order to help the district save some money. The teachers union voted no going back on that deal. So here we are again. The district could be laying off teachers if money is not found outside of the district to save those cuts. I don't want to put that on the teachers, no, not at all. Um, I, I will say that we're looking at a lot of different scenarios and we're not, tonight we hope to nail down um, a, a solid plan. We, we let go of aides and a few teachers last year, so it's very real. So when, when, when talks or threats of cuts come, we start going through seniority lists. I've done breakdowns of every licensure area, put it out, everybody knows where they stand as far as seniority, so people are scared, absolutely. Now, Union President John Mulvihill said his private meeting with the board went very well. He trusts uh, the majority of the people inside. They did talk about ways to bring in money, more specifically money around the school district here inside the county, and that could be an income tax levy. But no decisions tonight. School board members are still inside the Board of Education waiting to talk to people who still are hanging out late tonight to express their concerns and offer suggestions to the board. Boarding in Blanchester, Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. All right, Brad, thank you for that update tonight. Now, we should note if cuts do have to be made, that would most likely happen before the end of the school year.